So, it's like really official, official now, or what? Yeah, I, I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm happy for you, sweetie, but now that you have a girlfriend, your dad and I are gonna have to have a little chit chat with you about what we expect. I guess that's home. Your father won't be returning anytime soon, which is why Uncle Morgan decided to come pay a visit. So this is the life Kal-El chose. It's even more disappointing up close. You're not welcome here. That's no way to speak to family, Lois. Especially with young boys around. Where's our dad? When I left him, he was a crumpled heap in his little ice castle. Peculiar place to build a fortress. I chose the desert. Like to feel the sun on my face. Leave. Now. Jordan, stop. Oh, I see your son's inherited your false bravado. Jordan! Stay away from my sons! This is all you're doing. It was your influence that made him turn his back on his own people. Let them go. This is between you and me. I'm afraid we've passed that point, Miss Lane. But I will let them live long enough to watch you die. Impressive, Kal-El. But this changes nothing. I'll do whatever you ask. Just leave my family alone. Pledge to me that you will submit. And I promise to let them live unharmed. Clark, please don't do this. I submit. Take a good look at the man you knew, because it will be your last. I'm sorry. I needed more time. He was right. <laughs>